Carl Knoxville is best known worldwide for its racetrack, but also home to the Metro's closest drop zone. Our Griffin Wright joins us live from the Knoxville Municipal Airport, which is home to the Des Moines Skydivers Club. Let's jump right to it, Griffin. Good morning. Good morning, Justin. Now, Knoxville or the Des Moines Skydivers Club used to call Knoxville home in the 80s before moving to Winterset. Now they're back again in Knoxville and the community has welcomed them with open arms. We have been very well received by the town, by um, people in town that come out here. Um, there are several times I've talked to people that they see the canopies in the air and they just come by and they just watch it and they absolutely love watching us. To see the to see one of the best views of Knoxville, all you need to do is jump out of a plane. You're able to see all of Lake Red Rock on a clear day and Des Moines skydivers are here to stay. They signed a 50 year lease with the airport and only being a 45 minute drive from Des Moines. They live up to the name of Des Moines closest drop zone. I've always wanted to kind of make a skydive. I never thought that there was places like our place, you know, where you can drive to easily. Um, you know, there's places like this all around the U.S. I started doing some research and found that, you know, a place was like this close to me. I live in the Des Moines area, but it, it was kind of cool that you can do that. So if you're looking for a safe and fun way to see all of what Knoxville has to offer, maybe do it from the skies. And if you want to book a dive, rent a dive, you can do so on that website that's on your screen. Yeah, a lot of fun, very adventurous. And uh, the city mayor who will be talking with Kaylin Thompson uh, in the next half hour will be uh, is one that jumped from those planes. So uh, that's awesome. Good to see a lot of fun had in Knoxville. Again, thank you, Griffin Wright.